Oh, let's go shopping. It's a fiasco, I believe. It's a fiasco right around the corner. So maybe this time there won't be a big, disgusting, ugly monster in there waiting for me. Monster. Right on cue. Off of the leg. Oh my. Good aim, Poro. Go down the one, T. I need you first. Take it here. Dark meat. Why not dead yet? Kill it. Good day. There you go. Damn it. Seriously? You wanted me to watch, didn't you? Fall off again. Oh, oh. Yeah. Where was I? Something else here. Can I even get to that goddamn fiasco? Oh, that's an actual person. Look good. <clears throat> Set right up. Take a look. Whoa. Take oh. a look. Oh, just eight. You gotta be kidding me. Until next time. Why are you out here? Why is this an ice cone shop? I doesn't have crap. I see a dead civilian. Ah. Doesn't even have guns to protect him. <laughs> Price like a girl. There's a lot of health, seemingly. Oh, shoot the leg off. Come on, dog. Let's get ourselves to the Alban. Kicker. Damn, he has a lot of health. Need to hit shots. Should die by now. <clears throat> Come on. There you go. Why didn't he not use his gun? Pull this revolver, dude. Pull this revolver. I can't enter from here. Hmm. Something to my left where I can enter. Just a red light. This ugly blaze then. Quick save. <clears throat> right in time. So if you do it today and wish I had some to put to coax it into being friends, maybe I'll go get some from the factory and then feed it. Every poppy deserves a friend. I just killed the poppy. Oh well. Hear that? In my dog. Oh. Ah, oh, another wall. Yep. I think it's time to fast travel out of here.
Yeah, fear. Oh no. It's getting radiated. Before I can open Oh, I can open it. Oh, there's someone inside. Skeleton. Be a good guess. Oh, better. Explosives. And Rachel's in here. Hate those creatures. <clears throat> here come the radiation. And the poison. Yeah. Yep. Oh, I'm getting damaged. This. I should put a slate here. Sure, we'll be fine. Let's see where I wake up. That's the plan. Cut. I did not sleepwalk. Look where you're going. Where's Yvette? Need help? Yes. Sell what do you need? stuff. Stranger. Sure, I got something to sell. Crickets. Oh, no, that's not cool. No cause I should have sold stuff before getting here. Or before starting the video. Walking cane. And that's good. Okay. I'm rich. Let's hope somebody has some good inventory. Spent money on. Well, well, our little wayfarer has returned. <clears throat> You're looking in a lot better nick than when we first found you, I must say. I've been paying mind to what you've been up to round here. Seems you're not a bad sort, me old mucker. So listen, I got an opportunity for you. You can keep on doing odd jobs for us, help out here and there for a few tickets, or you can step up to the big game. I'm offering you the chance to join the ranks of the Vagabonds. Join our family proper. Your blood becomes our blood. Our fate becomes your fate. What do you say? I probably need to think that over. What do you want me to join? Truth be told, I'm not sure of you myself. But Blind Nelson says he smells something special about you. And I'd be fucking barmy to ignore his nouse. I've got me some big plans coming up, and if you've got the right skills, you could play a big part in them. What's in it for me? Weapons, armor, support, a bit of status in the streets, and protection if you're ever in a corner. Us vagabonds look after our own. Now, we ain't the only gang about, but unlike the rest, we ain't leeches. We ain't lording it over others, and we ain't fucking lunatics. You want to be someone's pawn, go somewhere else. You want to be part of a real community? This is the place to be. Real family. Mm-hmm. What is the fate of the Vagabonds? In a word, revenge. Mm. We've been at war with the fucking Isle of Dogs Syndicate for ten years. And for too much of that, we've been on the back foot. We need to switch things up. Take the war to them, and win it. Win it for good. And after that? One step at a time, eh? That's a big enough job for mm. now. I don't... I haven't seen too much of other gangs here, so... Let's just join in and go with the main quest. Sebastian Gaunt. Glad your gun's on our side. That's what I like to hear. But now, let's not get ahead of ourselves. I still have a task for you before you join proper. We're on a war footing, and every new recruit has to prove their value for the effort. You want to join the Vagabonds? 
You gotta show your loyalty and your worth. The job is straightforward. Put down a dog and bring me its collar. Not just any dog, though. I want the blood of a syndicate enforcer captain, and I want its lapel pin in my hand as proof of the deed. Do that and you'll truly be one of us. Speak to Nelson for more info. The other lieutenants can kit you out with some gear. That better get me Yvette as a follower. Nothing to say. Can I help you? Yeah. Goodbye. Yeah, uh, pull back. Okay, get me some gear. Hello, young plum. I want to ask me to kill Syndicate and force a captain. Can you give me any help? Help? I can't help with that. Can't even see enough to help you. Ha <laughs> ha! You got to do this on your own. No hand holding. But I'll give you a bit of background so you know what you're in for. The Syndicate has an enforcement division known by locals as the Sniffers. Their whole job is to keep the peace, as they call it, meaning meeting out a bit of the old ultra-violence against anything they consider subversive. Pretty cruel bunch, by all accounts. They tend to wander around in small groups round Millwall, looking for trouble. You'll find a few round Tower Hamlets in the Dome, too. Each group has a captain, and they're usually smart and tough. You want to get that pin off their collar, you've got to be smarter and tougher. And they ain't the complacent type, so don't expect no shortcuts here. Like I said, no hand-holding on this one. You're on your own, I'm afraid. Do please try not to die. Mm -hmm. Touch me again, and there'll be consequences. <laughs> you motherfucker ran into me. Careful. Got you before. I'll do it again. There you go. All right, Labra. What can I do for you? Guns. Guns. Wants me to kill Syndicate Captain. He said you could give me some gear to help. Wants more fill of blood, eh? Time to kill us some more doggies. Ah well. If that's your job, then I can help you live through it, I hope. If you're planning a straight fight, then I can give you some armor. But if you want to be all tactical like, then you can't go wrong with some well timed grenades. Oh I don't know what kind of armor he's gonna give me. Probably nothing good. Grenades. Good choice, good choice. Here you are, matey. If you hang round, wouldn't hurt none. We need the numbers. Do you, you need better? medical assistance? No, no. Goodbye. Goodbye. Bye, better. <laughs> okay, kill Winston. Going for spot of dog hunting. Go on, send me for supplies. Hey, no trouble. I had fresh deliveries of chems and medicines today. Which would you rather have your mitts on? Medical supplies. Here you go, mate. <clears throat> okay. That's some good to go, dog, right? Let's go, some dog, dog. Psst. Dogs. Oh, wait, there's someone downstairs. Oh, do I get a laser gun? Shortcut. Hello. What you after? The laser gun. I'm on a mission to kill Syndicate Captain Gorn said you could kid me out. Sure, I guess you need the right weapon for the job. You fancy a shooter or a slicer? Oh, shooter. Right, here you go. More bodies getting shite done never hurt anything. Drowned pistol, never heard of that. Let's see. David Drowned pistol, 38. Got nine rounds. Dead an ugly gun. Is that your laser gun? Okay, cool. Damn. That's gonna help me a lot with nine bullets. Thanks a lot, dude. Looking out for me. Where am I? Probably ready to go. I can right. be of service. Companion. Goodbye. If you hang around, wouldn't hurt none. We need the numbers. Yeah, you're the only girl here, seemingly. By the way, the mask. Hide my face. I'm a super female in the game. They told me where the forces are, but so far, it didn't show me on the map. So I'm not sure. 
and I'm probably just gonna chill. Let's see what that gun can do. A good gun. Thanks for giving it to me. Ammunition range. What's in here? Come on. Damn it, that's a sweet spot. So what pocket? No. Chained. Shoot the chain. Well, it makes sense. I want them to drop down. Okay, up we go. Did you get books? Overdue. That's probably not what he wants. Textbook. Book. Oh, how much he needs of that? Let's get the men some books. Damn it. Huh. We will. There we go. What we've been ticket and he dead. Burned. What would do? Get me the good stuff. Oh, I could activate the good um, robot in here. Nope. Apparently not. That's been quite crap so far. For books, oh, something good. So, good guns everywhere. Go okay, that's the trap. Let's just play with that. I have so much ammo, I can shoot him. Two rounds empty. Not like that crap, it's bad. Mm. Duh. I'm getting too tired to play. Say it. It's just a kitchen. Corned beef, that's a nice looking sandwich. It's not. Okay, that's the entrance level. Ah. 
Damn. I didn't, I didn't see him coming. He was so quick. As soon as he was on the floor, it was like... It was down and it's over. For the shit, boom. It's dead. Oh, come on, dog. Out of the way. Damn you. Shed bomb one hundred and fifty. Same thing. Damage wise. How? Oh. oh no. Okay, I don't need any of those. Toy car, toy truck, fancy airbrush. Now oh, for on, that's the way to get that hook from him. Die, go. Already hate this mission. Do I have been here? Yes. Oh, oh you're grabbing me. And uh, how did I learn lock picking for? Open that door behind me. Do something. No, that did not do anything. Hmm. Already hit it. Ghost Lama Fiction Day to Date What am I supposed to do with that now? Oh god damn Oh why did it take that? I feel like I'm well, I just give this mission up. Ignore it. Now I'm gonna circle around the building. I was I'm totally ignoring it. Ugh. I spawned in somewhere. And now I'm getting shot. Oh boy. Get off, you lousy mongrel. <coughs> Maybe there was other syndicate. Folks I need. No, it won't help if I uh, oh. anyways. I'll knock you out, sunshine. And I miss my shots. Off, you lousy mongrel. I will miss my shots. <laughs> Damn. Right, it better be the right person. There's a little dog sniffer there. Those are the right people. Wish that would do more damage. He's just skipping all the whole back. Come on, hit it. No, just go for the body. Ah. 
Oh, they ran away. Oh, you little slag. Fog is back. Get him, dog. This is never. Uh, what is that thing? 45. I don't have much of that. And so, randomly, finish that mission. Dog. Trade. That's not what I'm here for. Is it a landmine? front of me and I'll see one there take those goddamn suits but it's all well huh don't run into that um up here that's what we're here for Let's go over there. And quick save. Before getting to crap. Oh, dead end. Mm -hmm. Bastard. Oof. Tommy, and go this way. Some of those doors are just crazy that they ain't accessible. Look like they should be openable. No, it's just a game. You shall not enter the doors. the fiasco the mud dodge department store I'll ignore you uh. sneak by Game crash. <clears throat> Game crash. Ah, oh, Fallout London is getting to annoy me. Good job. Finally starting to annoy me. Mm. Game just wants me to fight. I know it. Should have used another gun for the damage for the first shot. Anyways. We got a few more bullets to go through. This thing is pretty stationary, but seemingly useless. Fuck! Oh. <laughs> ah. Oh. Oh. I'm not gonna hit him. Like that. I said. Now. What the hell was that? Ah, oh, it's suicidal so creatures. How many of them do you need for Lord London? Fallout 4 already has super mutants. 
split it, put nuclear explosions on reds too. Oh god. Cruel. Just cruel. Do you want me to deal with that? Oh. There it is. I see it. God. Oh, the game crashed again. The game crashed again. There. Let me show you the game log. Get them how that was updated is good tomorrow. I will probably be done. Screw that. Okay. Let's try this quest instead. Let's just sort her stuff. So it was kinda easy. How goes the hunt? Dogs is done. He's dead. He's the well, level well. I wasn't sure you had it in you, me old China. Very well done indeed. And good riddance to the dirty dog you scrubbed to get this. Here, keep this pin. Your first trophy is something to hold on to with pride. And take these threads. You're one of us now. So you ought to dress the part too. Welcome wow. to the Vagabonds. Now, I told you I had some big plans coming up. Come see me and the boys in the lounge and I'll tell you what comes next. Assault. It's time for those Assault. dogs to find out what happens when we bite back. I'm not wearing that, but thanks. <clears throat> He's probably gonna get stuck five times. <laughs> Running this way, dog. We get you better as a companion, as a reward. God, he's slow walking. I hate it. What he's getting shite done never hurt anything. Right. God damn. Take your time, mate. Take your time. Well, more... here we all are then. Listen up, lads. I've called us together for a reason. The dogs hit us hard last time, coming right to the center of our turf. Well, I didn't want no rash response, but now our heads have cooled, it's time we looked at how to bite back. The dogs are trying to get the nuclear reactor on their turf up and running. We've got to win this war before that can happen. That reactor could produce double the power Battersea can. The gentry would have the tummies in their gaff in seconds. They'd be untouchable. So now's the time to strike. And strike hard. And we've got us some extra help now. The lab rats we found down bridge is moving up in the world. This wayfarer is now a vagabond. Nice one. Good work, mate. Get in. You've had a taste of Syndicate blood, Wayfarer. I'm hoping you're hungry for more. We're moving to a new phase in the war. One that's going to see us much more active. And I want you as our new commando. Oh, I'm not smart enough. Oh, what do you mean by commando? You've shown you're good on your feet in a tight spot. And you've shown you can carry out raids in enemy territory. And you can keep yourself alive doing so. That's exactly what we need for some new, aggressive assaults on the Syndicate. 
Is this why the Vagabond's outfit didn't come with on the... What? Sounds good. What's my first mission? That's what I've got the lads here for. Chill, bullet tooth, shrapnel. I told you all I want new plans for how we can do some proper damage to the dogs. And new blood here is going to be our point person. What you got for me? <laughs> so talk to the people and choose what I want to do. This is what we need, boss. Syndicate always have more than us. Way more. We can't win a war without enough weapons. Syndicate get regular supplies from the gentry factories. I know of a depot they run in a warehouse by West India Quay. I say we break in there and clean it out. You must be joking. Security will be tighter than a rat's arse there. I'd have to send a whole team in to get more than a handful of guns. It's too dicey by half. I know a gal that might be able to help us. An old, oh. uh, associate. Okay. She it's could find better. a way past the systems there. At least long enough to shift some crates out. We just need someone to break in and open the loading bay from the inside. No, this is just stupid. Get your fucking brain in gear. I want to hurt the dogs, not do some petty theft. Anything we nick, they just replace in a week. We'd be better off burning the place down. Destroy whatever's there. Fancy security and all, and fuck up their supply operations for months. Wouldn't even take much explosives to fry a weapons dump. You're cool, boss. But there's bound to be some lovely gear in there. We'd be a crying shame to see it all go to waste. If we're burning a place down, then there's no harm in nabbing some guns while we're at it, is there? Okay, sure. But that's just some frosting. The real aim here is to fuck over the syndicate. You've been paying attention, Wayfarer. Mm hmm. Oh. You want me to break into the syndicate warehouse, grab some guns, and burn it to the ground? Good. Take these charges. Find a way into this warehouse and set them somewhere that'll cook extra crisp. And take this old card of mine and go see Frosty Valentina. She runs a bakery these days near Millwall High Street. She should recognize the card from our old days. I'd go see her myself, but the syndicate sniffers would kill me on sight. Tell her what you're about, and she can sort you with something to bypass the security systems. Waste of time. We don't need this Millwall bint. Hey, oh. no need to talk about Valentina like that. Fine. I just want the fucking job done. No distractions. All right, gents. So tell me, what does the Syndicate have in abundance that we don't? Web tools. Herpes. Literally everything. No, no, no. I mean, yeah, probably. But I'm thinking of one thing in particular. Supplies. While we're choking down squirrel stew and using rock gut whiskey to treat anything from the flu to a bullet in the head. The IODS has enough food and medicine to supply both of them and the whole of Westminster. I feel it's high time we alleviate them of some of that excess and put ourselves in a position to succeed. After all, health is wealth. So what are you suggesting we do about it? And if you say a train robbery again, I swear to God. Well, now, just hear me out. There's a train that makes up a third of the Syndicate supply line, and... Oh, for fuck's sake, Winston. You've been reading your bloody spy comic books again. You're not 006, or whatever. Give it a rest. Well, it's 005, actually. And what I read in my spare time has nothing to do with this. I really don't see what your issue is, anyway. They have supplies. They transport them via train. We rob the train. It's simple. It's not bloody simple. It's never bloody simple. There are far too many variables at play in a job like that. We broke even by the skin of our bollocks on the supply run to the lab, and you want to up the ante? Not a chance. Out of the question. That's just it, though, innit? You're looking at the ones and zeros of the returns from the lab. But the real intangible score of that job run is staring us right in the bloody face. What are you on about? What the wayfarer? Hmm. 
Not a bad point. All right, fine. Here's what we'll do. Let's send the Wayfarer to strap on a tux and play international spy. And if they don't come back, we're only back to net zero on that lab run. Happy? Seems like the more people we send, the better chance of success we'd have. But, yeah, sure. I'll take what I can get. Good. You should be thanking me for even agreeing to that. The stakes oh. of a job like this are still sky high. Seeing as if the Wayfarer fucks this up, the heat comes down on our heads like a red coat's deli belly. You hear that, Wayfarer? If you muck this up and get yourself killed, I'll yeah. find you in the afterlife and shit down your throat for the rest of eternity. Oh, we should kill you all right now. Oh, God. Can I tell him to F off? Yeah, yeah, just tell me what I need Excellent. to do. So the train passes through Poplar Station. That's where you'll be heading first. The station is a syndicate outpost, so you'll most likely have to put down some dogs to get to the control room. Once you're there, all you have to do is switch the train's route to Canning Town Station. Hop aboard, and Bob's your uncle, you're done. We'll be waiting in Canning Town to unload the supplies. Easy peasy. Yeah, I'm sure it'll be just that simple. What could go wrong? It's only the Syndicate's most important and highly guarded assets we're talking about. So in case it's not the sunny stroll in the park that Winston is presenting it as, take these explosives. If we can't have those supplies, Nobody can. Get me? If things start going south, blow that train to kingdom come. Even if we come away empty-handed, at least we'll muck up the Syndicate's main supply lines. But securing those supplies is still the main objective. So don't go blowing them up for the hell of it. Any questions? I'll do it all on my own. No, no. Good luck, mate. The lads will see you in cannon town. Quick, take this before Gaunt sees. Oh, spy pistol. 32 rounds, damn it. That's worthless. I mean, it's silenced, maybe. It will come Christ. This is such a mistake. You love all those ideas. But I get my hands dirty in other ways. I've said that. I've got an easy aspiration, boss. I say we take down the dredge. The mud chute prison boat? What do you mean, take it down? We crack it open? and steal the yoke. There's a bunch of our blokes in there. Lab rat here can sneak in, let everyone out, then set a few well-placed bombs to sink the whole damn place. I ever tell you you're a fucking lunatic, Johnny? You've mm. mentioned it a few times, boss. But, uh, what exactly is it about this that seems so mad? The dredge is guarded to the tits. You couldn't sneak a gnat's fart in there. Oh. And what's the good in blowing it up? Syndicates have been trying to call us terrorists ever since we broke out that friend of Yvette's. If we uh, bomb a prison, they'll just uh, use that as propaganda against us. Not everyone's fond of prisons, Gaunt. And our lot in there have some grit in a fight. Would be nice to have them back in our numbers rather than rotting in the clink. There's some logic in your lunacy, Shrednall. We could do with more hands. And it would stick it to the dogs if we break our boys out of the dredge. All right, tell our chum your plan, then. Mm. Oh, no, thank you for having it all for you, Dad. fucking -tastic. Here, three bombs is enough to sink the ship if you get the chance to use them. They'll need placing around the lower deck. Once they're set, you'll need a scarper. Quick, good luck, mate. That sounds like ten you hours of mission room. time. We need the numbers. We need the numbers. We need the numbers. Let's see what this Fletcher bomb does. Okay. <laughs> okay. Now let's say that's a dot. How about cricket ball grenades? Uh, That's the good stuff. That That's the good one. That's the good one. Oh yeah. That's all I want to see. Uh, never yeah. Huh? So you're not rustling round. 
Felt break coming. Oh, stupid. At least I got a safe point. Be better. Be better. Where's she at? Need help. Yes, follow me. Goodbye. Damn it. What are you looking at? Spring was cooling. My mother wanted me to be a farmer. Touch me Will again and there'll be consequences. <clears throat> oh, you that oh, Come on, lad. Oh. Fuck off. So, oh, I played like 15 to 10 hours. Eh, probably more 15 than 20. Bro, just need a break. Let's sleep. I'll see. I'll see. Probably no chance that I'll finish this. Anyways, too many crashes. Peace out.